In true Genta fashion, I kind of give up on this tutorial because I've made it several ways and none of them are good enough for me. So if something in this video is missing, just feel free to ask in the comments and I will know how to make a better video or I'll just address it in the comments. With that, let's just get right started. This is how I use the reality app to stream. Specifically, let's just talk about streaming. So first of all, you're gonna need the reality app. The reality app is available in Android and Apple. You may need to change your device to Japan to download it, and that's about it. Once you have it downloaded, you can make your own character and that's all straightforward. The important part is that you need to have your backdrop a solid color and make sure your floor drop also is a solid color because you have that option to do both. And he's still doing the fireworks. I'm trucking through this. I need this tutorial out, okay? I highly recommend using the dark blue as a color for your backdrop because it seems to be really good no matter what color your character is to chroma key out. Next, you will need to open or start your uh, reflector software or your mirroring software. Reflector 3 is free for a week and then you will need to pay for it, but I highly recommend if you are going to buy anything, buy this because you can stream multiple devices and it is very, very good. I like it. It does its job. I'm happy with it. So it's, it's, it's literally as easy as opening it. And then going to your phone, scrolling down to that weird little box clicking it. It might ask you for a code. For me, it doesn't ask for a code anymore because I do not care. And there you go. There's my character. A few things I probably should note about Reflector 3 is that you have to have your phone and your computer on the exact same Wi-Fi. I have three Wi-Fi uh, lanes in my house and I got confused when it wouldn't work. So if it's not working, like you can't find it to mirror on your phone or on here, that's probably why. So just double check and make sure. Now you're probably wondering, I don't like this phone thing. I didn't either. So you go over here, you click this, no frame, booyah. And you make this as big as possible to the far left or right of your screen. That's that's how I use it. The reason why is because this is kind of dumb re with Reflector 3. If I opened up my Streamlabs, so my streaming software, which you will need to do this, give it a second, there we go. When you do Reflector 3 and you have Reflector 3, you can't just simply like say, oh, I want a new scene. I want it to be like a window capture or something. You go to like a new source, just a window capture, and you scroll down. You go to Reflector 3. That's not the one you want. You go to Reflector 3. Oh no, what's that? It's a black screen of death. Why is it a black screen of death? They even say in their Q&A, that's just how it is. So you're going to have to not do window capture. That's just not an option. You get a black screen of death. So let's get rid of that. So instead of doing a window capture, you're going to have to do a display capture, which is fun. So new display capture. There you go. Display capture is fun for one thing and one thing only that you have to go and manually crop the hell out of it because there's no way you can get rid of this. Granted, you could probably make it smaller, but that'll like change, I guess, the resolution of uh, the quality of the end product, or maybe not. I actually, huh, I haven't tried making it really small. That might actually be helpful. I just imagine, yeah, if you, if you make this small and you try to blow it up in your streaming software, the quality is just gonna be icky. So I always make it big, that way I can see my character like this and I can just crop it out from here. So if you wanna crop it out, this is how you do it. You go bibbity bobbity boop, boobity bobbity bop. You uh, click on it, you go to transform. This is the first thing you do before we do chroma key. You have to crop out just this uh, screen part, the part of your screen. So you go to edit transform and you just start playing with it till you get it to, wow, that didn't move much at all. So you get it to go to where you want it to go. So let's try. That is way too much. 15. Nope. 15,000. Okay, that's a bit too much. Let's try 14,000. That's a bit too little. So let's try in the middle. 
there you go that's perfect and then uh, you would want to crop the bottom out just spam click that to crop the bottom out I swear guys I had a better tutorial <laughs> All keyed up, but no, my brain, it just gave me an anxiety, it gave me an anxiety attack. And I said, fuck it, we're doing it the gentle way. Because the gentle way is the best way. <laughs> okay, and you say, good for that. All right, so here I am. Hi. Now you're probably wondering, okay, I have it. Whoops, let's not ruin my stream. So now you have your character and you're like, okay, but it's like the blue background or the whatever color background you choose. Well, this is where chroma key comes in. I get to play with chroma key again. Yay. So you uh, right click on it. You go to filters. When you get to filters, you click this little plus button. You go and click the type, find color key. Here. It's going to be called chroma key, whatever key. And here you go. Woo. You're going to want to use custom color and you're just going to gonna fucking eyeball this, okay? <laughs> you just want to gonna eyeball it. I think this is the standard color. So you're like, oh, there's still a little bit of stuff. Well, you're just going to have to keep tinkering with it. So open the filter back up. You play with the how strong you want it. So about like this, like you can go all the way to 300 and it doesn't seem to hinder. You can like barely see the remnants. You don't need to touch anything else unless you specifically for some reason need to. Uh, just aim for like the 300 era. Like you could, uh, around 300, you can still kind of see it. If you did it all the way, you might lose because my hair's purple and that relies on blue. Um, you can go all the way to 600. That gives you an even more crispy looking thing. And that's how you chroma key your character. I swear I had a better tutorial. Guys, I swear I had a better tutorial. I just, I can't be bothered right now. The fireworks have been ruining my day. <laughs> and yeah, that's that's how you get your character on here. Um, this isn't a good tutorial. I probably will delete it. I don't know. <laughs> it's just... I can't! I've been sitting here for an hour and a half re-recording, re-re-recording, scripting and non-scripting and just, ah! It's not hard. It's really not hard, okay? If if you're dumber than me, I'm grateful because then we can be friends, but if you're smarter than me, this won't be a problem for you. That's all I gotta say. So if you, like, personally struggle with uh, anything in this tutorial, then feel free to give me a shout. I feel like this is gonna be an unlisted video because, my god, Genta, what is wrong? wrong with you <laughs> my god uh it's kind of the same thing with doing movies you know what why don't i just why don't i just stream this uh i don't wanna i just i'm a perfectionist okay it's hard it's really difficult it's difficult i hate this i hate it so much it's not hard it's only hard on me because I'm a perfectionist and I want to help everyone in every way because I can think of 150 ways to make this tutorial so where nobody has to ask questions but then it's going to be a long tutorial and nobody wants to see a long tutorial and then I'm going to have to timestamp the tutorial then I'm going to have to edit the tutorial and I just, just don't uh, uh. this is how Genta does it it's as easy as that it's as easy as download the app Make your character, make the background of your character dark blue, get a reflector three, free trial or otherwise, doesn't matter, I'd buy it on the spot, honestly, you can mirror multiple devices, it works, um, you might have to have a microphone to plug into your computer, or you can like, I don't know, I haven't tried using... I haven't tried using my phone as anything but just a character display. I, like, I, ha I have a Blue Yeti at microphone I plug in. Um, yeah, you get Reflector 3, you mirror your device, has to be on the same Wi-Fi, so your phone and computer has to be on the same Wi-Fi. Um, your, it'll come up like a phone, which is annoying as hell, so you just come over here, click that little arrow, go no frame, be like, great. Um... Yeah, you can make it bigger or smaller. It doesn't really matter. Then you just open up your software. You, you crop the hell out of it so it's it's where you want it to be. And then you can just move it all over the place. Chroma King's not... I thought it was hard. It's really not. Especially when you do dark blue. Dark blue is, like, the easiest to freaking deal with. Um, I guess I could cover how to have, like... 
a high quality stream as well because when I, I, I looked it up because you have to like look at your internet speed and whatnot, but this is, if you have a good computer and you don't lag, just where is, where is, where is, where is, I'm probably showing stuff I'm not supposed to. Please do not IP ban me or, you know, I probably showed something I wasn't supposed to. So like this, I don't know. Just look up some tutorials. God, I can't, I can't. Gent is dumb. Why don't I just do a Q&A stream? My fucking god. Somebody kill me! Kill me! Kill me. I'm done. Fucking, I'm out.